Good morning, good morning. It is Sunday, well, it is Sunday at 11.50 a.m. <laughs> I tell you what, I wake up so early every day during the week that on Sundays, I sleep late. So I, I slept late. I woke up at 10.30. So, anyway, yeah, I'm, I'm a, I look real good. I'm in my leggings, my postal shirt, my hair is a mess. I spent the night with my best friend, um, and we're going to be packing up and heading home because I need to, I re there's a laundry list of things that I really should do today. I'll tell you, I need to get my floats put away. I need to cover the pool. I need to throw away my dead plants because I don't know what else you would do with them. I need to weed my little walkway. That's what I need to do. <laughs> I would like to vacuum my car out as well. Um, yeah, so I don't know. We'll see. We'll see if that all gets done. I really should do it because like during the week, am I really going to do it? Getting off at 7? Probably not. Uh, and also, I didn't vlog last night, so there's that. So there is not, I don't know what to do about that. I think I'm just going to put in the community tab that I don't have a vlog for the day. I'm sorry. But like, I just, you know, I hung out with my BFF last night. So, you know, there's, I doubt she wanted me to be like, hey, talk to the vlog. You know, I mean, she probably wouldn't have minded, but I don't want to do that, you know. And Maddie was playing and, you know, it was a good night. I took a bubble bath. I did. <laughs> very relaxing um, but I just want to come on the vlog and say hello good morning how are you but for right now I'm gonna take my really messy bun and start getting ready to head home and you know <laughs> hopefully do all that stuff hopefully it will all get done um, it would be good if I could get it all done today and it doesn't sound like a lot but it's like your only day off do you really want to do all that stuff but I need to be a grown-up and responsible and do that so I think that's what I'm gonna do anyway I'm gonna go ahead and go and I will catch back up with you probably outside in the backyard we we are just now leaving Walmart just now leaving Walmart I'm telling you people today they're trying to run me over you got any manners and I rolled right past right through the uh, exit didn't stop no I didn't stop sometimes I do but today I didn't feel like it because they made me mad you know when they check your receipt it didn't stop not not doing it yeah so we're leaving Walmart and we're going home because that was just too much <laughs> like seriously man spending the night with my girlfriend <laughs> she just got a cat she only has one cat and coming home to my zoo is irritating okay irritating my cats have no respect for anybody they really don't anyway I'm getting so tired of just not cooking and not, you know, throwing a pizza in the oven for Maddie. I'm tired of it, which a pizza is very convenient. You know, we'll do that like once or twice a week, but I don't want to do it every single day. So I have decided to cook at least twice a week, which if I cook two big meals, then that can last us the whole week for leftovers. So today I'm going to make in my handy dandy crock pot, which is right there. <laughs> I'm going to make a chicken Alfredo dish in the crock pot. It looks like it's plenty for tonight and tomorrow, probably the next day. So that's what I'm going to do. I feel very homemaker-ish right now. You know, when I didn't work and I did just stay at home and take care of the house, I, I did, I cooked a lot. I did a lot of stuff because that's a job in itself if you're a stay-at-home mom. That is a job. Some people don't think it is, but it is. Anyway, yeah, so... I'm going to put this uh, meal in the crock pot and get it cooking. But yeah, when I got home, woohoo, I had to do the litter box and just, you know, because I like to vacuum like three, if not three, then twice in the morning and at night. I like to vacuum, vacuum everything because you have to. I mean, there's no way. Could you imagine if I, I have all these damn cats and I never vacuumed and like sweep? So I did all that stuff and that's done. Uh, Maddie cleaned her room because it was a mess. I told her we just got that room all situated and nice. You got to take care of it. So got everything done. I'm going to put that in the crock pot. And then um, I think I'm going to vacuum my car out and go out into the yard and start doing that stuff that I said I was going to do. But it's hot. I'm like, what's up? It's hot. It's like 87 degrees. Breaking a sweat over here. I really like my mermaid. I know. I know, guys. It's like September 22nd. 
I think most people decorate for Halloween like middle of October, but not here. So you know, November 1st rolls around, Santa's going to be here. Santa's coming November 1st. Um, anyway, yeah, so I'm going to get started on this crock pot dinner, and I'll show you what it looks like. But I'm, I'm excited. I know, that's crazy to be excited about meal prepping, but I am. So this is what it looks like. It's got two cups of heavy cream, a cup of chicken broth, some butter, the two pieces of chicken, and that's it. Uh, and they say like it's supposed to cook for two hours and then you shred the chicken and then you put in rigatoni or whatever you wanted to put in but that's what I chose and it's going to make some kind of magical chicken alfredo dish in the crock pot so we shall see the only thing I had to buy at the grocery store was the chicken and the uh, pasta because I didn't have I had everything else um, but you know we'll see we'll see how it turns out this would be very keto friendly without that even though i'm not a, like i don't even know if i'm two percent keto even though i'm not like i'm trying to start getting back into better like following it but i'm telling you working at the post office and delivering the mail like it really it's been hard to stick to that it really has i'm not I'm gonna lie to you it's been hard to stick to it but I try little things like when I want a, a treat or a snack, I will, you know, make one of my little keto cakes or that's what this uh, Jello is for because you can take heavy cream and Jello and whip it up and make it almost, it's not the same, but kind of like an ice cream. So, you know, I'm trying, um, I'm probably going to eat this without the pasta and maybe make a little bit of cauliflower and put it over the cauliflower. That would be good. Um, because I don't want to gain back all that weight I lost and I lost about 70 something something like that 70 something pounds you know and sometimes I'll play back the footage and I feel like maybe it's just me <laughs> but I feel like my face looks fatter but it might just be me or the angle <laughs> I don't know, but I just get worried sometimes because, you know, it was hard work to lose that weight because that's not losing weight, losing weight and stopping uh, quitting cigarettes. Hardest thing ever, even though, I mean, I vape, but anyway. Um, yeah, so I got that in the crock pot and I'm going to take a little break. I'm going to sit on the couch for a minute. Maybe when it cools down, <laughs> we're going to go outside and um, start working on this. But, yeah, I hope you're having a good day, guys. This one is hard. Llama time. Man, is there like an easier way? Because like, it's easy to blow these damn things up, but dang, getting the air out, golly. You'd think it'd be easier. Shoot. All right, guys, I got all the floats, all the floats in one spot. And I think I'm going to put them up in the attic so they stay, they don't get like frozen and crack. There they are, guys. This is what it looks like so far. Said it was going to be done in two hours, although I know with slow cookers, it takes longer, but it's definitely not done. You can see the chicken right there. And I feel like this is going to be a thin sauce because isn't the sauce with like Alfredo thicker? I don't know. But we're going to still keep going, and I'm sure it's going to taste good when it's all finished. Thankfully, I've got some leftovers that she can have tonight, so this will just be for tomorrow night because it's already 6 o'clock. But, I mean, it smells really good. Right now, we're going to work on the toes. It's been about two weeks, and it is time. We're halfway there, guys. Um, do you guys file your toenails? I do. A very long time ago, I had a pedicure done, and they did that. They filed them, and ever since then, I do. I haven't gone to have, like, a real pedicure in, since that last time, and I think it must have been over 10 years. Anyhow, do you file your toenails? 
I feel like it makes it smoother. I just feel like it makes it a little bit better because when you cut with like that thing, it makes it like the edges rough. Uh, but anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and paint my toes. My toes are done, my toes are done. I painted my nails too. We'll see how long the nails last. My nails are so short. <laughs> I never had long nails, but they were never this short. So anyway, um, my feet feel so much better. My toes feel so much better. I feel like I have fat little toes. <laughs> Who has fat little toes or like long weird toes? I feel like this toe is always like the weirdest long toe on anybody. I'm like, yeah, I don't like that toe at all, especially that one. I feel like it's long and like weird. Um, but anyway, yeah, um, my toes are done. Look guys, it's finished. I put the Parmesan cheese in and the rest of the chicken. Look at this. It looks good. And I guess it, the sauce did thicken up a little bit. Yeah. I'm about to make Maddie some of this. And that's plenty to last us a couple of days. So, wow. It it, it was super easy. If I remember, I'll link the um, recipe in the description. So, you guys, if you want to try it, it was really super easy. And it looks really good. Hello guys, it is the next day and well it's 6.30 in the morning and I did not close the vlog because last night I fell asleep. <laughs> I slept great. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and just quickly close the vlog. I love you guys and I will talk to you tomorrow. As always, I will vlog again tomorrow. Bye everyone.